Hey there guys, what's going on? And welcome back to the Ultimate RTG. And it's Thursday already. It's come around quick. Foot champs, division rivals, we're ready. But before we get into that, I need to spit some facts. FIFA 19, we packed Red Mbappe. Then we got another one that I decided not to take for some reason. I don't know, I think I made a mistake with that one. And then we got Bless with an untradeable Team of the Year Mbappe. So what does that tell you? This account, which is still the account that I was using on FIFA 19, it is engineered and geared towards an Mbappe. It just makes sense. And I'm gonna go as far to say, I know this sounds ridiculous, but I'm gonna guarantee an Mbappe in today's video. I've got that feeling. Like I genuinely believe we're gonna either see his red or we're gonna get him from that Team of the Week pack. It might sound crazy, but I think it's gonna happen. And as we have been selling a few players on, we're getting ready uh, for some big purchases. So boys, if you're enjoying this series, please do leave a big thumbs up. We have a uh, Foot Champs Elite 2, as well as some tradable division rival rules I'm gonna take. And if you want to keep up to date with football news around the world, one football, download the app, links can be found below. You think I'm gonna get Mbappe? Let's go and find out. So division rivals, I was playing a lot last night, so I should be in rank one, but it's promoted me up to division three now. So I think I'm gonna to have to grind, either take the pack rewards or just take coins and then get back to division four. Because yeah, division three, division two, I don't think that it's looking uh, that great. So 50K pack, prime goal players, all good. Um, we still got the ultimate screams in packs and I think later tonight they're going to either re-release the whole ultimate scream again for another week which is mad so if you've got those scream cards I think uh, I would get rid of them and then we're going to be seeing like a guarantee of one of those ultimate scream SBCs so Jesus the market's going to crash boys but anyway we need to focus are you boys ready foot champions Let's get it. Elite two. Oh my, those coins. Elite two, boys. And we're going to be getting those uh, player picks. We have a selection of five. Are we going to see an Mbappe? Who else is in the team of the week that I want, though? Uh, Fabinho, I wouldn't mind trying. Uh, Sal, that looks good. Uh, any others? I can't remember. But our main focus is Mbappe. Please. Come on. My only decent red pick this FIFA has been Semedo, and he was amazing. Like, I've been using him quite a bit. So if I can have one of the best players in the team of the week, that's only fair, right? Which one do I start with, though? What am I feeling right now? Tell me, right, left, or left? Which one have you picked? Left. I felt left. All right, boys, are you ready? Oh my God, Mbappe, please. Yo, please, I believe it. Come on, three, two, one. Red Mbappe, please. Oh my god, man. No, today is going to be a special day. Are Jose Perez? Hell no. Fabinho? That's more like it. What? Reds? No, we're getting Mbappe as well. Fabinho and Mbappe. Red Fabinho. Um, 81 strength. I like that. Stand tackle. 90 interceptions. Jeez, we need to try him out. He might be similar to a 9 goal line. Obviously, he doesn't have that pace. But with his defensive awareness and 90 interceptions, that is a mad looking card. And he's going to be pricey on the market. So Fabinho, we will take. That is a massive start. I'm telling you, I feel it. I feel something big coming, boys. And we've already got one. But we're just warming up. This is going to be a serious pack opening. The best pack opening on FIFA 20. Pick number two. Mbappe, Mbappe. All right. All right. Pulisic ain't bad, though. Do I take Pulisic or Jose Perez? I haven't even checked the in-game stats. So, 4-star, 4-star, medium-medium work rates. He's got okay stamina. His composure is really, really low. His finishing, in fact, is quite low for an inform, but he's got that pace, and that's all that we care about. But with uh, long shots being nerfed, I don't think that that stat is really relevant. Well, I, of course, it's going to be relevant, but, I mean, if you can get inside the box and it's a different story, uh, the agility is okay. Like, he doesn't look that great. I'm not going to lie. And then Ayose Prez with the 85 finishing, he looks a little bit more playable. Ayose Prez, Pulisic. Oh, man. I'm going to take Ayose Prez. I'm just going to take him, boys. Spanish as well for some requirements. If we need that, I don't know. But the last chance to get that red Mbappe. Or we're going to be saving him for the team of the week. You never know. The team of the week pack guarantee. All those tradables. Mbappe, you're coming. I know you are. So Fabinho, Ayose, Perez. And Mbappe. Oh, it didn't happen. It didn't happen, boys. All right. 
Uh, false alarm. We will get him from this tradable team of the week. He is coming. Uh, what's this man? Terrible. Doesn't really look too good. Uh, Pulisic, I guess. Or Chilwell hasn't really received a bad card. But Pulisic is... Yeah, he's fun. Those aren't bad reds, though. They're pretty decent. Fabinho, solid. Uh, Jose Prez, I will use eventually. And then Pulisic. I mean, we got the Premier League boys. But we need Mbappe. Let's go and open these tradable packs. So we're back up to 668,000. Obviously, we're going to have to rearrange the starting 11, but we are very close to completing it. All that we need is about 400,000. I know it's a big ask, but all of these packs are tradable. Can we do it? Let's find out. Prime goal players to start things off. Just warm up. No, 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 no. We've already warmed up. I want big pulls right here, right now. That's a walkout. I see that glare. No, come on, come on. I really want an icon. And that's why, with the amount of coins that we have right now, we can do it. We can pull the trigger. We can uh, bring in an icon, which is going to be fun. It's fresh, and he's new. He's new, new. And I want to uh, also um, just add to the attack. Like, obviously, Human Son is definitely on the radar right now. The Bradka, best keeper in the Prem. Uh, Abraham, on form right now, smashing them in. But I need to uh, bring in Human Son. But we could see a return... Of Lucas how do you feel about that although we do have like fresh faces I don't really want to go out of my way to the point where I'm building a team that yes I'm bringing in new cards but it's just gonna put me in an all disadvantage you know like it's not I just don't see the point so you're gonna have to give me your opinions towards that but 50k pack boys let's get it at least a walkout I have to see some walkouts and big players it's all tradable that's that's a glow please walk out no, that's an inform. I can tell the difference now. Colombian, right mid, no idea. Yeah, didn't think I had any idea as to who that was going to be. 75 rated, I'm going to discard you for 10,000. It's still coins are coins though. I'll take like 20 um, discard informs. That'd be sweet. Uh, Romagnoli. Whoa. Oh no, he was in uh, ultimate screen one. Damn, that could have been a pack right there. Oh, he's in screen one. It's okay. No problem. Jumbo has to be a walkout, man. Has to be in a jumbo pack, please. Come on. I need to make coins, a lot of coins. Otherwise, I'm not going to be able to finish this team. Right, come on, come on, come on. Yes. What is it? Show me. No way, Suarez. Suarez. Yes. How much is he? How much is he? 89 rated. Oh, come on. He's got to be about 50,000. 60,000 coins, 70. 70? Oh, please, man. Suarez, like years ago, you'd be going mental for that card. 400,000. But these days with that pace, uh, you know, I'll take a 70, 70, 80. Price tag, maybe. Is he? Come on, come on, come on. Oh my God, and Zagadu as well. Suarez, how much are you? 40. 40,000. Hey, do you know what? That's still a good pull. I'll take that. 40,000 coins. Let's get it, man. Is he any good on the game? Like 70 sprint speed, 76 acceleration. Mm, good strength and aggression. And the playmaking is there. And then when you're going to get him inside the box, he'll score everything. But it's just that pace. He needed an ultimate screen card. Then I'd be interested. But for that price, 40,000, he is gone out the door already. Uh, Zagadu, that's not bad. Anybody else hiding? Um, no, not really. Oh, did you see the new um, CSL? Was it CSL? League SBCs. Um, they look pretty good. Those cards, like you've got Edda that looks very much playable. And was it Jonathan as well? Uh, those cards are good, but very pricey. 100,000 to complete the whole set. Mm, don't think it's worthwhile, but mad, right? So I'll sell those in a second. That's more like it, EA. Keep them coming. We need those big players. So... Yeah, we are comfortably on 700,000 right now. I've got a few more players to get rid of. I think we're going to be able to do it just. But Mega Pack next, and then that Premium Team of the Week. That could be the Clutch Pack right there. Saving the best till last. That's another walkout of some sort, no? Oh. Good luck today, though. It's been uh, so far so good. Striker, uh, British Dortmund. Oh, I can say. Nah. It's all right. 83 rated. Maybe here be going for something because of the League SBC. I still need to do that myself, though. Uh, Rooney, nah, Mount, uh, fitness cards, yes please, I'm spending a little bit too much on fitness cards right now, which is kind of pointless, 
But boys, it comes down to this one. If I, all right, all right, put it this way. If I don't see an Mbappe, because maybe EA have played around with a pack weight on FIFA 20 and it's rigged my account. But if we don't see an Mbappe, I will take a tradable Fabinho or a tradable, yeah, just a tradable Fabinho because he's the most expensive apart from Mbappe, I think. Are you ready? So we need to see that Brazilian flag or obviously French. I have to get a walkout to start off with. So three, two, one. Come on. It could be Mbappe, man. He could change the account right now. In 10 seconds time, the whole RTG has changed. Oh, okay. No, it hasn't. Uh, Brazilian, nah, I don't think that's going to be who we want. Thanks very much. Christ's sake, your elite rewards are trash. Yo, they are actually so bad, this FIFA. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. It's Elite 2. I, t I, t I tell you, whenever you get Elite 2 or Elite 1 or Top 100, you don't get anything. Elite 3 is where it's at. Like, you need to finish in Elite 3. There's no point pushing for the next couple of ranks unless you know that you're feeling good on the game and you're going to get Elite 1. But, no, that is... Awful. Like, that is absolutely disrespectful for BA. Uh, what are these players selling for? Not even selling. Like, come on. Uh, 10,000, 10,000. So, really, you're just taking a trade all pack to get 30,000 coins. That's really what it comes down to. So, would you rather open up an extra 100k pack? I think so. Honestly. Extra 100k pack. Would you make 30,000 from that, though? Well, I just did. I got Suarez and he was 40k so it just goes to show maybe we're gonna have to put this to the test but let me get rid of all of this stuff sell everything see how many coins we have and then maybe start making some nice purchases let's go from there so after Suarez sells and we clear out the club just a little bit we should be on roughly like 800,000 which is a lot to work with but not really when you're wanting to purchase a certain icon but Pepe was sold in the last one after that draft win sick run one of the best I didn't concede a single goal and we dominated but 25,750 love that Manolas was sold the day before and Hazard last night 384,000 I don't know what's going wrong with him but I just can't afford to figure that out like especially in the weekend league if he's not getting goals or he's just not really like value for coins i think we need to wait for a special version and then we bring him back and romagnoli with these ultimate screams that are dropping i have to get rid of him boys so 90,384, and there are a couple of players that i'm interested in so obviously the number one priority was to bring in ronald kuman i think looking at his stats like comparing him to ramos is a big upgrade like he's got the interceptions he's got the composure reaction strength aggression and playmaking i really really wanted him but Cannavaro is on the cheaper side and i don't know why people are set on the baby version over the 89 look at the interceptions the reactions 93 the composure the strength and aggression which i think is really important now after the patch because you need to push into your opponents to like knock them off the ball and then the baby version is more expensive just because of the pace now nah, now nah, i'm interested in the 89 and for his price at like 500,000 that gives us a few more coins to work with to improve the attack and this one for 565 now nah, I'm just not interested so something that I had in mind if I made like a few more coins was this obviously I've got players of chemistry but Dembele would be playing as a right attacking mid I would have to use Lucas as a left attacking mid and then Hyun Min Sun as our striker with that five star weak foot and then that's a big upgrade on what we already had so 437,000 it's it's really really pricey it's pretty much like I'm, I'm paying I'm paying for an icon when you're buying a human son and I'm wanting two I'm wanting Cannavaro and human son I could clear out the club even more and see what I what I get I mean nine Golan is going to have to be played on seven chem eventually with um oh would he not be on seven chem as a left mid or am I or am I not doing it properly? Would I have to bring in like a, a, a Belgian manager from the Syria? Maybe, I'm not really so sure. So if we don't go for Cannavaro and I go for like a Ronald Koeman, how the hell do I finish that squad off? Is it even possible with the coins that we have right now? Or should I just ignore the icons and start bringing in some uh, regular versions? But obviously with this team, 
like Lucas makes a return for chemistry. Um, Human Sun I haven't used. We've still got some fresh faces, but you can see some of the original starting to come back into the mix. And it's not really my fault. I just can't get chemistry any other way. And I did I did say like, if I'm having to go into the weekend league at a disadvantage, it doesn't really make sense. But that's where I'm gonna leave today's episode. We've got 800,000 coins, potentially 800,000 after I clear out the club. What do we do with them? Do we buy like a massive player in the attack or do we buy like a really good player in the defense to carry our team? I'm not sure. I'm going to leave it down to you. But in tomorrow's episode, we will have our official foot champs weekly side ready to go. So yeah, don't stress it. We're going to be all good. But thank you very much for watching, boys. Leave a like. Good luck in your reds. And I will see you on the next one. Team out. Peace.